Don't have any cash? Charge it. More and more people are ditching cash altogether so they can use the credit cards. And some businesses are encouraging customers to pay with cash by offering a discount. But at least one business in our area has consumers very confused. Liz Crenshaw is here to straighten us out. Hey, Liz. Pat and Wendy, you're seeing it more and more, an incentive to pay with cash. But one area fast food franchise is trying to make ends meet in this tough economy and at the same time rewarding customers who pay with cash causing cash register confusion. I think it's a sneaky way to, to do business. Eric Wong of Montgomery County, Maryland, couldn't figure out what exactly he was charged for his chicken and french fries at this Popeyes. I noticed that the total was a little bit off, so I looked at my receipt and there was a 57 cent charge on there. And for? It didn't say, it just said <laughs> ESF. E, it just said ESF, so I asked the cashier what this was, and it didn't seem like he really knew. This is the sign posted at Popeyes. Pay less with cash. Receive a 60 cent cash discount on cash sales $5 and over. Sales $5 and over include a 57 cent service fee. Huh? <laughs> Getting something to eat at a fast food place should not be this complicated or confusing. Eric Friedman, director of Montgomery County's Office of Consumer Protection, says consumers rarely complain about charges for fast food, but recently he has received a handful of written complaints about some Popeye's restaurants, including copies of receipts with unusual charges. It's pretty confusing. We've got two things going on at the same time. They're offering a discount if you pay by cash, and at the same time, they're charging an extra fee for everybody. The extra fee, or ESF, the owner calls it an economic service fee, a fee to make up for the rising cost of food. And instead of raising the prices on his menu, he decided to impose a 57 cent service fee. So what about the discount? That's a 60 cent rebate for the folks paying with cash. So some receipts look like this, an upcharge of 57 cents called ESF, and then a credit of 60 cents because they paid with cash. Friedman says it's perfectly legal. What's illegal is confusing consumers about what's really going on. We spoke with Christopher Gobi, the owner of the Popeyes franchises charging these fees. He says he implemented a small economic service fee, ESF, due to continued rising operating costs. He says the cash discount is an incentive to cash paying customers and says signage at the registers informs customers. But Friedman says the consumers he's heard from are more confused than informed. These people are upset, they're confused, and they're passionate. I say definitely misleading, uh, definitely confusing. We did contact Popeye's Corporate, and it says it does not mandate any such fees. Each of its franchisees are independently owned and operated. However, it is offering coupons to the customers who filed formal complaints with Montgomery County's Office of Consumer Protection. Eric Friedman says, I don't really hear many complaints about fast food very often, but this cash versus credit and then the extra fee, very confusing for folks.